when you actually start self-doubting yourself, you also start thinking and try and also become like a perfectionist, right? So how does it feel to um, have a perfectionist around you? Or- so in my case, it's a very different scenario where uh, I and my husband are in this business. So he's more into the securities while I, I hit the real estate term. And he is more a perfectionist, while I am more opportunistic and more uh, a strategist. Actually, when the stock markets were doing really badly, we went into real estate correctly at the correct time. And that was something that was uh, a very good thing for the group. So every move that I made was quite uh, you know, a positive step for the company. I think the results showed Otherwise, like, you know, when you are a, when you have a male in, in this uh, equation, in Sri Lanka, I feel I was uh, having a chat with Nisri and also, it's in Asia, I guess, like, you know, you, uh, you know, the, the general public will praise the, the male figure and uh, underestimate the female. So even in the company, like if I thought certain things have to be done, I was very pushy. For instance, there were there was a you know a land that we had to acquire, and it was in the middle of nowhere. It was where actually the the cinnamon life was going to be, uh, and 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 my husband was like, "What is this land?" So I knew this land was going to be really precious and it will appreciate and I was like no I want it <laughs> okay and I stood by it and uh, here we are like you know this huge development has come in the middle of it <laughs> so right. so those investments actually we did for the company that just uh, made uh, us now a conglomerate what we are okay.